Give me another one. Go on home, baby. You're blind drunk. I said, give me another one. Come on, you're out of cash. Go sleep it off. <laughs> Thank you, Frank. Oh, it was a lovely evening. I think I'm going to sleep till Monday morning now. Oh. Well, uh, what do I do until Monday morning? After all, you're my only date for the weekend. <laughs> um, no, Frank, I didn't ask you up here to... Oh, Frank, come on, please. Please, don't spoil everything. Um, okay. <sighs> no, Frank, I don't want to. Okay? You're gonna go home right now. Well, Christina, why don't you face your problem? You're separated from your husband. You're a free woman. You've got to forget the past and make a new life for yourself. At five in the morning. 
a weird kind of life it would be if I started now, don't you think? And swimming in vodka. <laughs> Let's go. Margarita? Margarita, calm down. Calm down. What's wrong? Well, Leo's helicopter crashed. No, he's still alive, but he's badly hurt. They've taken him to a hospital in Como. How is he? Where? All right. Have you called us, Waldo? Have you called us? No. No, he's not in New York. No, he's in the Bahamas for the weekend. I'll call him. Yes. Um, you leave for Como right away. Yes. We'll meet you there. All right? Margarita? Be strong. Telling me, is he alive? Yes. But it's bad, huh? Where? Yes, in Italy. Christ, on the company plane just went in for an overhaul. Never mind. Wait for me. I can be in New York in about six hours. Yeah. And we can take the Concord on from there. Christina. Swear to me, Leo's not dead. Okay, do me in. That situation? there is the brother. New York, the Bahamas. The playboy, huh? Yeah, and that's the that's sister time. Margarita with her latest French husband. And how about that? The American next one. The whole goddamn family. Yeah? Only natural, I guess. Oh, yeah? Yeah, Freddy buys the farm. They're in line for quite a stash. Have you found out anything about the chief physician here yet? He seems to have an excellent reputation. This time, he's not treating some boy who's broken his leg falling off a bicycle. He's got the life of Leo Ferretti in his hands. Oswaldo, in my opinion, we must take Leo somewhere else. To the best hospital, with the best doctor. We must make a decision right away. It's... it's up to us. Did you consult Leo's personal physician? Yes, we did. We have to weigh things and give it careful thought. We don't have time for careful thought. We all know that Leo has always made the decisions in this family. This is one he can't make. If you all don't want to take the responsibility, I will. Well, I... Uh... It's not so easy. It is for me. We'll take him to the hospital in Geneva. I want to make sure my husband comes out of this. He's not your husband anymore. For me, he is. And he will be as long as I live.
Remember my children, Dr. Satani? Alberto, his wife, Julia, and this is Maurizio, the youngest. How the years pass. They're grown men. I'm sorry, but we have no time to lose. The helicopter's going to be ready in two hours. Yes, we're taking Uncle Leo to Geneva. I spoke to Dr. McCluskey just now. He's going to leave tonight, and he'll be able to make his examination for some moment. Isn't home green better, the guy from Sweden? No, McCluskey's the best in the States. I have total trust in him. I'll go with Leo and Dr. Satani in the helicopter. Maybe you should stay here. There are going to be a lot of details to take care of. There's the press. Alberto, could you uh, deal with them? Sure. Thanks. So I guess all that's left is to uh, decide who's going to stand in for Leo at the office. It's incredible, the organizational skills that you possess. I don't know how we survived without you. Perhaps you don't realize the seriousness of the situation, Maurizio. If we don't hurry, Leo won't survive. Sorry. So, well, I've never understood anything about the business, so I think Oswald is the one to take Leo's place. Me? Oh, no, no, I'd never know how to. I've been abroad for too long looking after our New York company. I'd be more of a hindrance than a help. Well, in that case, I'd say Maurizio was the obvious choice. He's always been the closest to Leo and his work. True, true. We'll see. But the main thing now is to call a shareholders meeting. These are going to be a difficult few days. Remember, you can count on us. Thanks. Bonjour, mademoiselle. Oh, the morning. I hope that's coffee. Sure. 